How to use DeepSeek R1 in a useful way that's going to completely change how you think about using these local LLMs. So the first thing you're going to want to do is install Olama. The second thing you want to do is you want to pull the model that you want to use. I'm going to click on DeepSeek R1 here and then you can choose which one is going to work on your system. You can create a Python JavaScript script that interacts with Olama with code and calls the model. So what does this actually look like? I just went to ChatGPT and I said write a script that connects to Olama and does something with Olama through Python. It gave me this very simple script here and you can just take this onto Visual Studio Code, paste this. So we change the model name here with this model name. And then I'm gonna save this. Now, if I run this Python pi.py, what is it gonna do? It's going to send this prompt to my local version of R1. There we go. So here's the thinking and then SEO or search engine optimization plays a pivotal role in enhancing the online product, blah, 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 blah. Okay. So this this is really, really cool, right? So let's make this even more useful. So I just said to ChatGPT, add LLM JSON mode to this, please. Also, my model is DeepSeek R18B. So if we copy this script here, what this does is it says provide a JSON object with SEO tips for small businesses. So we actually have the basis of something very, very interesting here. 